we couldn't decentralize a database. Okay, we had to have it in a central hub like a Facebook or a Twitter uh, or a PayPal, uh, which are great companies, don't get me wrong, but uh, we couldn't do that until Satoshi invented the blockchain. And that is a way to have global state, that is to say, everybody knows how much Bitcoin somebody has, right? Everybody can access it, everybody can read, read it, everybody can write to it if you have a little bit of Bitcoin, and everybody can write blocks to it if you have a little bit of, a little bit, a lot of computation at least, so many blocks. Point is, it opens it up. It takes so basically, it takes things from 51% to 100% society if you run yeah. things in a distributed way, because every, everyone gets to opt in to whatever things they want to be part of. Yeah, exactly. It becomes much easier to opt out of something, right? Yep. Because that hub no longer has control. Another way of putting it is blockchains turn, I know this is technical, I know your audience, you know, but basically um, blockchains turn every user into a root user. You have total control over your data, over your money. Um, you cannot be deplatformed from it. You can't be censored, okay? Um, and, uh, you know, what we're thinking is, about is that a problem if you can't be censored? I mean, what about, there's always a question, what about, we talked to Ashton Kutcher earlier, who's like saving all these kids from child, you know, ch child abuse material. What about child okay. abuse material? Like, are there ways you can censor some things and not others? Or, 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 or is there, is it just better to yeah. even have, you know? So, so the, the issue is with everything like this is that, um, you know, it's saying hard cases make bad law. Yep. Right. So hard cases make bad law, meaning that, the like if everything is premised on the edge case which is a variant and that is governing the base case that's probably not a good solution for the base case right yep in the, in the case of like extreme content like that um there's a couple of options right the the first is if you look at how bitcloud works anybody can set up a client to bitcloud which is to say you can set up example.com and render the posts however you want. It's as if yeah. Twitter's been acting was totally open and everybody could render the tweets however they wanted. How, how Twitter used to be. But, but no one has to listen to them and people can still report them to the police or, or et cetera. Yeah, it, exactly, that's right. You know, the thing is, um, even from a pure utilitarian standpoint, I think that edge case harm is often exaggerated to, uh, you know, to, to, to basically control 99% of people, you know? And have, have you seen that yep. cartoon, which is like, how do you want this wrapped? And it's like terrorism or like the children, you know, and it's basically like internet, you know, filtering. Yeah, so ba basically, the, basically people use the edge cases to get control and to have the centralized control, but then the centralized control ends up doing even worse things overall. And so you're saying it's, it's better. This is the whole concept of liberty to begin with, which America was founded on, is that you have liberty and, and you deal with the edge cases without get, getting rid of liberty, basically.